Sean is on the way with a motor grader. A ding! Nobody, there's only two ways to get a message in my world. Is either get something to do, start doing something, or you know what else. And then that's how that happens. Ding! <laughs> okay, well he'll be here any minute. So I gotta make room for this big motor grader. Apparently it blew a bearing or a, a seal or, uh, I'm not gonna go into that. And uh, so uh, we'll see him coming down, down the drive in a minute. Maybe one day I can get him to take this stuff off and cash out on some of this metal. I got a trash can, somebody donated a trash can the other day, that was nice. Uh, and then we got his uh, fencing back there. I need to mix up, mix up another three gallons of weed stuff. God, holy dang, it's just unbelievable how much weed stuff. Uh, it's locked. Okay, we'll see him pulling in and I gotta move the tractors. Okay, he and it have arrived. And we're gonna try to get it in here. Uh, I don't think that stuff's gonna be in the way. Uh, probably move it. We got all this room here to get her in here. And uh, he hasn't seen my topside creeper, so I want him to, I don't think we're gonna be needing it in this circumstance, but I just want him to know he has access to it. A little kangaroo pouch. Is there a kangaroo down in there? Did you see that? I guess not. Cause there's not one. Okay. All right. Well, we've got a nice little breeze going here today. I got some cool drinks in the, in the refrigerator. Usually when he comes, he needs to eat something, but I've been making something. Easy. I got all kind of snacks up there. Well, I've got the wavy gravy ramps up. It won't be too wavy gravy here soon. So apparently there's some problem. He'll, he'll explain it to us. Hmm. I don't know. Is he hooking on something? They said it wouldn't go forward. It looks like it's going forward to me. A lot of this stuff is maintained to the minimum degree. Uh, believe me, I've seen it. I've rewired most of this uh, thing. Uh, the, they have to fix it in the field a lot of times, and that can that can really lead for unhappy tidings later on. Get him to go around and scrape the weeds up. I've got some crate grading I would like to do around here. I don't know. I don't know why he keeps going back. I guess he's having to nurse it in here. Good thing about the big old barn is that you can get equipment like this in here. You don't have to stand out in the sun and there's a cool breeze most of the time. I'll probably open that other garage door behind Bonnie. Well, looks like it's working out. Zoom in a little bit on that. Alrighty, well, I don't know. Ah, yay, it's in the shade. See, it looks, it looks bigger. Fear magnifies scary objects or something like that. It's not as big as it seems. See, compared to Bonnie. Bonnie's uh, 18 feet, 3 inches long. Yeah, he's going to make it. Uh-oh. I don't know what the problem is here. What's the problem here? Uh, you want to go that way a little bit? There you go. <laughs> oh! Sounds like a chain case to me. 
You're gonna, you're gonna hit this, put it so there you go. See it articulates in the middle. All right. Yeah, we can do You don't wanna work on this carpet, do you? I don't care. It doesn't matter. We'll move that TV. Yeah, that's all right. We'll just pull it forward. If you don't mind. I don't, I don't mind moving it. I don't want to tear your TV up or that daggum. Barber chair. Well, barber gonna chairs. Be, are, this is where the, this is where the wheel. I was going to say. I guess I think it would be right there, wouldn't it? Yeah, it uh, have to be right there. All right. Yeah. Would, would it be easier to? Uh, I don't know. We'll, just push I mean, it up. And, we're we're gonna do it. <laughs> so a lot of people are fascinated by this because they don't. Okay, we're rolling tape now, so start cussing. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, we get we do got a three ton. Okay, we're good. Yeah, we got a three ton now. What's what's happened here? You just broken a bearing in here. Remember last time we tried to put those uh, that chain on the sprockets and bearings and all that stuff and yeah. all that? Yeah. That's probably what we're going to have to do now. Okay. Well, that's fine. But I don't know all the details we got the textiles here to, to swing it. Everybody gives me textiles. I'll, I'll take them, too. So, uh, all right. See? I can absorb this kind of work and like it. I want, to, I want to get his opinion on this. Might get a little weeble wobble before he comes back in. Got to turn the truck off. Oh, Tarkus, yeah, Tarkus. That's uh, kind of a hippy dippy song from the '70s, I think. Emerson, Lake, and Palmer. I think he don't even need to bother pulling that in the shade. I don't think. Don't have to worry about that tile. So it's two o'clock. EST. Well, I don't know what that was all about. <laughs> I guess he just wanted it there, okay. He want it there, he want it there, I guess. Let's open this window, get a little bit more of a cross breeze. If I, I thought, I'm usually good at locking them things, but. Okay, everybody down. Okay, everybody up, I forget. Okay, that sounds like it, all right. Yeah, he'll be in the shade in a little while. Got a new tool here for you to look at. What'd you get? I got one of these. So when you're working on your truck, you can you can oh, you can oh, one of those. Oh, and you can adjust it up and down. Oh, so you can crawl. Oh, I see. see okay. Then okay. you can lay down and work lay on down stuff on and work like okay. that. Gets a little, some exercise. Ooh, gets a, yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 yeah, whoa, look at there. Look at that, he's doing, doing the butterfly stroke there. <laughs> Showing the butterfly puppy on. That's pretty nice. So yeah, I figured that, especially working on, you know, uh, you know, if we're working on motors like this or like your big truck out there and, and Daphne. Anything, yeah. Because, you know, Daphne's got, you know, she's a GM, so the distributor's at the, against the bulkhead. Hey, that's a ticket right there. So, Please. Yeah, it's very strong. It's not a, stand on. Yeah, don't, oh. yeah, it's. And it's got the best locking wheels I've ever seen. They, they look at them things. See, they, they actually latch. They're not those little stupid things yeah. that, that have just the, like the little brake. Cool. They actually click, and it moves like a breeze. Oh yeah. Okay, so what do you want to do first? I'm gonna jack her up. Uh, yeah, we're gonna have to get her up in the air. Okay. And uh, let me get this thing over here, and we'll have something to sit on. See what you can do is you can put some wooden blocks under the, under the blades. Yeah. 
Whew, too hot for a hat. Here's my hair band. All right, he's got a jack stand going there instead of running the jack. I think that's, that'll be fine. Better to have these on. He's doing something there. Getting it under the frame. This is that. The reason it has two wheels and they're both in drive is because this is a chain box. And there's gears in there. There's a main primary gear and then there's secondary gears on each of these wheels. And that's stuff where it's there you go. And those, those, are, those boxes are full of oil. So a lot of times I gotta reach my whole arm up in there and hold things. So hopefully it won't be that bad. But we, this seems to be a common problem with these. Uh, it's a very, very dirty environment. Is it in there? You got to like a fella that worked okay. on his motor grader on a pineapple carpet. These two, <laughs> yeah. these two are, are both a little big. Okay, so. So it's under seven eighths, be three quarters, I think. So my thinking is that would be a three quarters and that might be, third, no, let's just take that one. Yep, got it on the, let's just take, take with. Now Bobby, Yo. what I'm probably gonna do here is get these covers off and drain this oil, see what we got. Well, I got lucky. Mm -hmm, it's right. a 13 16. 13 16. And there's a three quarter, we'll just put it there. All right. <laughs> now, I'll drain this, pull these covers off. They have to drain it, clean the box out real good. And then I'll have to go get the my chain and all the parts that I've got for Okay. It. Well, you're and in I, far enough for us to close the door. Yeah, I got to see how bad that that thing is. Uh, is that the right one? Wait a minute. Yeah, that one was that's swinging one. Yeah. wild, man. Yeah, that's the one. Okay, it just, it just morphed back into the whole exposition. So. Okay. Now, you, you want to blow that off? Oh, my gosh. She dry? Oh, the chain's not even on. Ooh, it's beat up pretty good, too, isn't it? They the chains. They put no damn oil in the damn thing. There's not a drop in there, Sean. And the good. chains all bunched up down at the bottom. Yeah. Just put it wherever you want to. You want to put it on a piece of cloth? I'll just sit down here. Okay, maybe the rain will clean it off or something. Uh, well, that's pretty tragic right there. See, that's what I'm talking about. No maintenance. And then I have to find. Then, then the only time it gets fixed is when it breaks. Yeah, well, there's a little bit of oil down here in the bottom. Uh, Let me go get him a, uh, uh, let's go get some professional lighting here. All right, let's get the Streamline Pro on this one too. You're lucky I let you come back because you never brought me that magnet from Rock Auto. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see here, let's take this. And this, and maybe a little extra in this thing. Let's see if I can impress my friend here with my my tools. All right, I'm going for the oil drain now. While we're doing that, hey, if you would, Bobby, yeah, I'll push down on that front end just a little bit. Okay, and take this out. Oh, wait, there we go. It's coming. Okay, let her down, down nice easy. Yeah. Uh, hang on one second. Okay. Oh, okay. Perfect. Well, that don't look too good. <laughs> no. Boy, blew the hole. It didn't. It wasn't leaking because there wasn't enough oil in it. So let's look at the bright side. <laughs> you can't give the shortstop an error because uh, he wasn't there. <laughs> Okay, we'll open up that box right there. Okay, let me, this is, just this you put it just anywhere you want to. So open up that box and see if you can find what you need. I'll uh, push them outboard. That's all, that's all, that's all. And then there's your extension and your 3 8 drive. Let's try 12 and see what it is. So you gotta get down in here. Oh. 
How's that? It's pretty good, man. Works well, pretty it's good nice. around here, don't it? Yes. Don't worry about it being dirty. I don't care. Uh, it looks like a five sixteenths to me, but I don't know. All right, this is this. Oh, I see. Yeah, see, I see, one's English and one's yeah. Let's go to the next one down and give her give her the gun. Give her a whirl. Got it? Mm, that's it right there. That's it right there. And there's your That is a one quarter. One quarter. Okay. I knew it wasn't three eighths. Oh, you need a quarter drive? Let me see. Is it a quarter drive? Yeah. Okay, let me go get you. I got a snap on quarter drive. We'll knock her right out. I would have never dreamed it would have been quarter drive. Quarter, quarter. All right. Let's take a couple of these. I don't think they're, I remember putting them in and I'll, I don't think you got a lot. Here you go. Georgie Fame and the Blue Flames. Gee, what a mess. More oil in there than we thought, but I don't think that's enough to pull up on the, see the chain busted down in there? That's why I like using that, uh, what do you call it? Um, putting that, uh, Slicky lube stuff. Uh, Lucas. Lucas. Yeah, all stabilizer in there. Wow. You got it? Okay. That's pretty stout stuff for quarter drive. Yeah. Now the other one will come off a lot easier. Usually when you break one side, the other side comes off easy. So this and is this your... one just has one, one, one on, on that side. <coughs> oh, okay. Cool. So we'll there, so. And uh, so this is a nice four-cylinder motor here. Kubota. Kubota. Suzu's not bad. Okay, we got that part off. Yeah. Got that for you. Oh. Oh. All right. Now I, I you want me to get you a, a, a tub? I got to get you a tub of cleaning solution or something. Oh, I'm in a. I got a case of. Uh, what do you call it? Purple it. power. Cleaner. We'll take this outside. Okay. Oh, what do you call it? Brake cleaner. Brake clean. Oh, I got five gallons of it. Okay. Okay. Let me go. Let me go get the brake clean uh, gun going, and we'll. And I don't care if you get it on the concrete back there. I don't think it'll hurt it. Uh, where's my brake clean gun? I just fixed it the other day. You think it's still working? There it is. Oh yes, we're over here with the brake clean. Let me give that a little. Let me give that a charge. Oh boy, I like that song. I don't get to hear it very often. Oh, and I've got plenty of uh, uh, ultra gray and all kind of other silicone. So okay. we'll just, uh, yeah, I guess there's no sense in worrying about the dirt going in the box because we're going to clean the box too. Yeah. I'm thinking of just going ahead and doing this for you. Can't hurt. I've got all these. Uh, uh, Everybody drops by and gives me things. See, I keep a supply of these. And I'm thinking of just putting some of the, the brake cleaner in here. And uh, just doing it that way. How about that? Try to save these is what I do. Da -da -da. Or better yet. Da -da -da. <laughs> okay. Oops. All right. Here's a, here's a brake clean in a bottle. <laughs> okay. And I got about four gallons left, so whatever you want to do. I guess we're probably going to need an air wand here sooner or later. What's an air wand? You know, just a long oh, wand. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Blow pipe. Long blow pipe. A long blow pipe. Yeah. Okay, well, okay. Also known as this. I had to rebuild this with some JB weld. But this is one of the things I got from when I restored that mixed 69 Gladiator. And he gave me a big, uh, a big thing for snap on. Did he make? Did he get? Did he get a lot of money off of that thing? I don't really. He did okay. He I did he okay? Probably made okay. There's on somebody it. out there wanted, wanted that thing, huh? Yeah. Yeah. What a piece of cool. business that was. Whew. Yes. Yes. Oop. And uh, that's okay. And uh, that 350 Buick engine in it with that crazy oiling system. Where yeah picks up in the front and goes to the back and 
you have to pack it with Vaseline to get it to get it to pick up. <laughs> they oil. do that because of the odd terrains it has to go in. Yeah, oh, sure okay. It has to get oil all the time. Not like a conventional vehicle. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think all out because a lot of times they uh, those military vehicles will get in compromising positions and for a length of time they'll starve for oil. You know, because it rolls around in the pan, and, and then next thing you know, they got blown the engine. Mm. Well, I, it, I remember you had it was it, it only developed like when it was hot with like 40 weight in it, only about eight pounds at idle. It was so low, yeah. Uh, but uh, that's unusual. And then I, I kind of this was a long time ago. Then I found out that it's the plate where the two gears go, yeah. And then I kind of machined that plate and I got it up to about twice that. Okay, so but you know. Daphne, uh, it idle is you know, fifteen or twenty. Cold idle, she's up. She goes up to sixty. Yeah. But real hot, she'll go down. But at idle, but what a mess. Yeah, cause I, I got to put the seal back on this. Do you want to? I got here. And I have to put the uh, what do you call it? Uh, I got to put the breather cap back on it. I'm gonna go in here and get something for him. Cause under here. I was gonna say uh, that at one point and I didn't, I should have. Well I just figured, you know, you're you're the man, so it knows less than I do. But in hiding in this in this thing is uh, something that may help me. Okay. Now I can get you a pneumatic uh, brush too, but here's a here's a brush if you want to use it. Oh, okay, thanks. Yeah, that'll work. And you just use all that you want to, and I'll get, I'll put more in it. So I have I have row lock disc and wire wheels you can put on drills and. Oh, we don't have to go crazy like that. We we'll just okay. get enough to get the metal down to the metal, and then we can put a. A seal. They used to make gaskets for them, and they quit selling them. Well, I've Nobody got. Ever used that, right? Which one? Don't Which well, I got this right here. As you can tell, I'm a fairly well-equipped shop. So I've got, and you you do me good using this up. There's a, there's your ultra gray. Oh, okay. Oh. All right, Bob. I believe that's gonna do right there. You want some more in that thing? I'll put some more in. Maybe one more shot. Punch the races out and put them in. Mm -hmm. The bearing, the, get the bearing in and get them out. So, anyway. Well, good. Well, I got a slide hammer if you need to, if you. Uh, I'm pretty sure, and I'm hoping and praying. That this is gonna be the ticket, Daddy. You want more? No, this will be it right Okay, now. just put it in wherever you want to. We, we'll probably get some more here later. But, okay. Uh, all I want to do now is see if I can retrieve that chain. Okay. Well, I, th I think that's. Is that one still connected to the center? No. Drive? No. Uh, wait. Yeah, it is. No means yes. If that chain's broken, which I, yeah, it is. Pins came out. I'm gonna pull it out. And see where we're at. With that. Okay. I've got new new chain at the shop. That gear got the beat out of it. Yeah, I got a new gear too. Okay, good. I'm gonna bring everything. Yeah, just bring everything. Bring all you got. Do we sing Chain of Fools right now? Chain, chain, chain. Yeah. <laughs> chain, chain, chain. There you go. You guys get a. This is that, that's called a. What gauge chain is that? They uh, I believe it's 80. 80 gauge. You don't see that very often, gang. Heavy don't see duty. that on your old Schwinn bicycles yeah, from Captain yeah. Kangaroo, do you? Heavy duty duties. <laughs> yeah, somebody had to work pretty hard to... I got more buckets right there if you if you want them. I'm going to use them for something. This is from where we had the horse. Big horse bucket. Well, we didn't put the horse in the bucket, but it's... Uh... No, that was for the pool. That was... Okay. It's the only kind of horse I'd have when you could put it in a bucket. Practical horseman me. That's right. <laughs> Practical horseman. 
I practically want nothing to do with them. Oh, that's good. Sweet. Those are no good. I'm gonna put it in the old bucket. Too. Yeah, you might as well put it together. Hey, you can come get all this metal. Yes. I got a load on that truck. It's ready to go, but I just haven't had time to go. Take well, just if you got room, come get more. I got more for you. Oh uh, yeah. Oops. That That's was your. That was that good. master link thing. Clip, master link clip. Well, there's some. There's going to be some. They shrapnel. left a lot of. There's a lot of shrapnel in yeah. here. Yeah. All right. Well, we, you saw the. Saw the mean of it. I don't think it's worth putting any of this stuff in the ultrasonic. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that axle. I don't know. That's probably too. It would go in there, but I think you can just spray that with brake clean and be okay. Wow. Talk about your heavy metals. You want a magnet to to fish around in there? I'm gonna go get you a magnet. I'm just getting the, the stuff, the big stuff that I can see. Okay, let me go get a magnet and we'll fish around in there. As I would give it to you. Nothing would be copyright claim. I don't care. Let's see. That one's a little too. Let's take him both of them. This one here is just that was a little too good. This one's a kind of mediocre. Those are the only two I got. Never really needed more than that. I probably need to order some brushes. Like here you go. Take this parts brush and that and that stuff there and Wipe up the bottom. Oh, I will. I'm gonna. I scrape the bottom down there. So I'm gonna take this wheel off. Come out, and then I gotta get it to where I don't okay. need this wheel on here anymore. Okay. Okay. And let me take that off. And then we we can we can just get a parts cleaning brush and just brush that down. Yep. And that'll be done. And come out that. And then all the metal bits will go to the bottom. We can, we can do. I, what have I got? I got another kind of brush. I used to have a stiffer one. Oh. Noise alert. I think it's in it. There it is. That might be a better one. This parts washer, obviously, I don't use much anymore. But it, it had its day. This brush is a little stiffer. They 13 16 on one side and they put three quarters on this side. <laughs> so there's, there's no way I could be wrong. You, you couldn't be wrong on that. <laughs> this is a good stiff one right here. Oh, that thing hurts you, boy. Get you. It's nice having the air compressor up. You don't have to hear it so much. This looks pretty grimy coming out of there. Yeah. So he's been working hard on that. You know what? What? I'm going to try this. Oh, okay, I'm going to stand over yeah, here stand then. Stand back. I'm just going to go <laughs> I got a power washer, but it just... Oh, if you change your mind, I want to do the power washer first. You can do the combo trick of the brake clean and the air both at the same time. Got a pretty good air tank. Come out here looking like you got freckles if you're not careful. over here so I won't forget them Oop, here we go this is a pretty cool motor we did a lot of work on this that exhaust manifold I think was the busted one and I did a bunch of charging work on it you can tell I did it and I'm a humble man Ooh, smells like brake clean. Okay. He's doing that trick. That's cool. We were having the discussion of a lot of axle guy. You want some more? Yes, no. he, I think that's the fourth time he said that. <laughs> Four times he said that. Can you give me some more? But a lot of axle guys say you don't need to clean the bottom of the disc and all that stuff. And I, I don't believe that. Get all the, everything out of there you can. 
This doesn't rotate quickly enough to really be a problem. You sure you don't want me to fill that up? I'm going to fill it up one more time. All right. Let's try to get that a little out of the corner. And you got that spray bottle thing. Well, I got that fan on. This had the wind kind of dropped. Well, he, he's pulling just unbelievable amounts of shrapnel out of there with that magnet. Don't know a secret. Do you promise not to tell? Okay. Just whenever you turn that on, say action. Look at that. Say action. <laughs> oh, hey. Lights, camera, action. <laughs> no cussing. Oh, you can cuss. Cuss all you damn want to. <laughs> don't think we'll be saving that cloth or anything. No. Well, you don't, don't go waxing your car with stuff like that. <laughs> God! <laughs> You look at what he's pulling out of there. There's a lot of metal in here. Golly. So we years of neglect. <laughs> blink. Something went blink on your phone. This if over there on the on the that table was made out of the 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 packing material for the packing ends for the list. Man, this shit just keeps making stuff, man. Maybe I ought to just drop a magnet down in there. <laughs> Drag it around. And just put it down in the bottom. And, and leave it there. Well, and on leave the other there. graders, I did. I put a real heavy duty magnet in the bottom. Let me see what you got in there. Look at that. I think that might have been. Gosh. There's all kinds of parts in there. Now you got a motorcycle noise coming at you. Well, I'd offer you another that, cloth. That's going to be... Just throw that in there. Sheesh. More metal in that in there. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, that's pretty good. Yeah. You, you going to rinse it out some yeah, more? Yeah, I'm going to rinse it one more time. Okay. Well, it's coming out not so bad now. Look how shiny. Shiny. coming out pretty clear now. Okay, let me get over here. Action! <laughs> here you go, here's your clipboard and a pen. Okay. Nice. Oh, you, oh, you got your own pen. pen. Yeah, you keep your pens. That's the one you keep over there? Yeah. yeah. You better keep that one. Okay. Bearings. If you want to get uh, inner. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, you meant consarnate. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I said action. Oh, did I didn't hear you? Sorry. <laughs> I, I, bearings. Bearings, seals, chains. Lucas, if you want it. Inner. Outer. Seals. Uh, check. Axle. Question mark. And your gear. Gears. Just, uh, you said you were just going to get everything. Gears. Uh, okay. So, Chain. So it's just after three. Thanks. Gears, chain links, and let me oh. make sure. Let me make sure the sealant is. I got a bunch of. I, you know what I've got that may be bearing. better than that. We can use it up too. It's stuff for gear oil, and I'm not figuring on doing any. Uh, just take the whole thing back there. Look at that! I got a brand new tube of it, and I got a brand old tube of it. I knew I had a little bit of the other. Bearing and race. What do you call it? Uh, bearing and race. It's called a race. No, the, the outer, inner and outer cone. But what do you call the thing? Dies to knock the bearings and the seals out. You know what I'm talking about? 
Oh, let me show. I got a kit. Let's see. If, let's see what we're talking about. I got a kit from Snap On too. And remember, we had to get that one because I got that stuff for gear oil. Okay. Uh, let's see what I got. I think I see it. These are my special tools. That's one of my most special tools right there. That's my tap and die set. see here uh, I don't know if this is I don't think that's it because it's too oh that's my uh, flaring tool uh, let's see now I've got this thing yeah what do you call those just uh this knocks in races oh, seal, driver, seal driver yeah and I got I got this seal if this will help us get the uh we're gonna need that uh, it that? goes this way oh we might need that but i doubt it because uh we just maybe get it to pull the races out yeah so there's that all here you know. okay uh all right. bearing race and seal driver kit all right we got that all right Axle gears, links, gotta get that. Inner and outer seals, bearings. Okay, one, two, three. I don't think there's anything else up here gonna help us. Those are interesting things. Those are you can put this in your on your tap and die sets and then change it over to quarter or three eighths. And this is uh, that that is a uh, kit to put in can bearings. That is a front plug remover. Yeah, that's for removing things like that. Uh, removing uh, freeze plugs or core stop seals. That is for cooling system. And, uh, okay. So if, even if you don't get parts, you could, we could do some, you know, prep on getting that other axle out and getting them races out. Now, do we have, uh, yeah. If you want, hey, if you got anything that'll fit, Bobby, um, yeah, we need to get this one out, and we need to get that one out. Now that one is like a like a regular wheel cap. We just take that hub cup. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So or, there's your old bearing back there. That's the old bearing hanging in there. Yeah, and that's the old race right there. So, well, we knock that out this well, way. Yeah. We what can, we could do is, if you get the cap out, we can just get a piece of steel and just drive them out from the other side. Right. Right, yeah. or we can get one long enough here to go to the other yeah, side. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. Those will be handy when we go to put the sea, uh, races, races in. back in. Yeah. yeah. All right. But uh, yeah, I think you know we'll just leave. We'll, we'll get that bearing cap off and just get a rod. And I, I, I think I've got a. I think I got some steel rod. Oh, incidentally, so you don't forget, you can have those. You can have those. Oh, these. Yeah. Oh, sweet taters. Okay. <laughs> those are duplicates. Are these foot pounds or pin pounds? They're both. I think you can just look at the scales. I'll tell you. So, yeah, just bring everything you got. Yeah. So I got this uh, spare the rod and spoil the motor grader. Okay. And uh, we got this thing here. So the trick here is we can use this to knock that bearing cap out. And see that'll that'll knock those races out of there, and uh, that'll just make that easy, and uh, that'll be good. We'll go put it in the freezer so they'll come out easier. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. yeah. All right. We're just gonna leave that there. Keep it there. Keep it there. That's that's not too terrible if you got the right parts. I gotta get your reaction to something I did. You ain't seen it yet. I got a couple of things to show you. So. This door is, we're going to just do this for now. Okay. So, I got Rex the Wonder Tool and, and I put in this tile landing. You like oh, that? Baby, I like that. That's cool, man. So. Yeah. Yeah, that's a lot better. Yeah, yeah man. And, you know, it looks good, too. Yeah, it took me a long time. You don't time. have to grout the between? No, just... I don't think I'm going to. I think the dirt that I track in will grout it. Yeah. <laughs> I was fixing to say, I didn't know if you if it's made to go that tight or you just put it that way. I just put it that way. I put it, it, I guess, you know, you can put tile spacers and stuff. You can don't use my cloth cloth. Oh. Use, 
You can use whatever you want yeah, to there. And I want to show you something else I got the other day. That looks good though. I like that. Yeah, now. Nah. Now, what'd you do? Just put glue behind it? I had to make all Adhesive. these. I had to use a piece of plywood and then I had to make these long running shims. Yeah. And then I had to glue everything. I put the. Because this has tar paper under it. Yeah. I put tar stuff back under well, it. That won't come undone, will it? No, no. It's, it's glued then. I use Gorilla Glue. It looks good, man. This is our boroscope endoscope or also known as little camera and it goes i got a uh app on my phone now what do you what do you do with that you can you can peek down in motors and look around oh, and no no kidding no kidding and so you can uh so there's let's see under bathroom stall doors and see stuff. yeah see that and you <laughs> yeah well it's just what you want to do and uh <laughs> so this is what, what the cops use when they look for burglars inside the wall or something yeah a swat team that's oh, where that's... You, can, you can find the little keebler men making electricity <laughs> that's what the, that's what those dumb people have dropped yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the ones making little electric, electric pods right yes. yeah okay and so it comes with this stuff yeah so what? one of them is uh is a magnet okay and so you can look down in there and see if you drop something and get the little magnet and pick it up Oh, sweet, man. And then this is a 45 degree angle thing. So that's the reason. So, what do you thing. do? Just plug that into your camera? Don't have or your to. Phone? It, it, it's, it's Wi Fi. And you can put oh, that on there and you can see sideways. And if you get it, the hell and out if of it's here. not magnetic, it comes with a little. So, you little just put hook. that on there? Let's see if that's, I can get this thing to work. Wow, man. I don't think I got any. So, it's Wi Fi, so it comes up on your phone? Yeah. Is that what it does? Yeah. And it's it the charge lasts a long time. Look at that. Let's turn that thing down. Let's see if I can get this going. Okay. Uh, it's uh, not a sponsor, but that's who it is. So start, okay. And you do this. It's kind of hard to get it going. Mm -hmm. And then you go into uh, spectrum. I kind of don't want to show my stuff. And then so you just hold it like that and you see it. Is that how it works? Yeah. And then it's, hook, it's hooked up now, and then you go back, and then you hit that, and then you hit this button here, and there oh, you go. check it out, man. Look at there. There I am. Oh, i got to turn it upside down. Which way? Does it have a mark on it? You can which... actually rotate it here. Oh. You can hit the rotation button there and rotate oh, it around. I see. And, uh, the, yeah, there you go. No, can't show me. <laughs> I, now i got to delete that. No, he didn't see it. Okay, all right. Yes, look at the, I'm going to make pizza, homemade pizza crust tonight. So what do you want me to do? Just just wherever you want to go. Oh. Just do the yeast thing because that was colorful. Do it doesn't. How come it moves? Oh yeah. How come it moves so slow? Is it's it just to? it's just the way it is. But when you're down in a down in an engine or something, you're not moving too fast. Right. So, what do you okay. think of that? It's pretty cool. Yeah. It's pretty cool. And let's see. What do you think of? Uh, what do you think of that? Sweet taters. And what do you think of? Yes, yeah, refrigerator ain't much. Man. He got like a oh baby. All right, so hit the spot. Well, let me go. I don't have any more beer here. I don't so don't I, feel too bad about stopping and getting any. Or taking the last one. Uh, no, there's some down in the barn. I'll go get one. And I got your place over there. That's all. I, I, I didn't know. I, I didn't have time to stop. I didn't even think about it. And I didn't either until I got here. I said, Okay. Daddy, I didn't get no beer, Bob. So I, I better drink up all the beer. In heaven, there is no beer. That's why we drink it here. And when we're gone from here, well, our friends will be drinking all the beer. That's actually an old German song. It's like the hockey song. Nothing like... That's pretty funny. You know that hockey song? The best thing I can name is a good old hockey game. And a good old hockey game is the best thing I can name. It just goes over. <laughs> yeah. it's, a, it's a drunk song, you know? Yeah. <laughs> They're like a drinking song. Drink, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so we've got three beers, but I can't have them. Why not? Oh, one, oh, I thought they were all this. One of them's kind of frozen a little bit. Oh, look. Okay. This, 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 one, this one's okay. 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 All right. Well, you got the, good, you got the, uh, you, you, got, you like those beers better anyway, don't you? Well, it don't matter to me. <laughs> After the first one, it don't matter. Oh, don't fall for those power stop brakes. What power? I don't know if you see them. They're junk. What is that, what is that stuff? They're just like EB, uh, EBC brakes are the ones you want. 
They're made in England. Now they opened up a plant in Oregon. They're the uh, best brakes for disc brakes. And, uh, oh, I usually try to, on most stuff, I usually try to get a, I get my stuff from British Parks Northwest mostly. Okay, but I'm talking about like if you put them, well, so it doesn't really matter, you don't have anything else. Yeah, action. All right. I got a new theme song for the Silverado commercial. That's strong. Because I see so many of them get worked on. It's Patsy Klein's I Fall to Pieces. <laughs> I think Rain Man Ray had like seven in a row. And, and he... He has a Chevy truck and his left rear window fell down on his extended cab and he fixed it and the next week the other one fell down. <laughs> um. Okay, I'm trying to bring the door down on this. Boys alert. <laughs> All right. Woo. Hope he doesn't run over the bridge too far. Nah, he's he's already done that. <laughs> okay, give me a thumbs up and like and subscribe. I hope this was entertaining, as entertaining for you as it was for me, at least as tiring. We don't have to worry about mice. They don't seem to be coming in here anymore. Don't want any mice in your shop. All right. Talk to you later. Talk to you tomorrow. There'll be a part two. Bye-bye. Hmm. You might wonder what that orange cone is over there. That's a valve I put there a long time ago. It used to run water to here. And then uh, rained a whole bunch, and they came out and did some farming and sliced that line. And then I had to put this line in. But I just ran it to a spigot. Things are like that. Huh? A bunch of ants around here. Just leave them alone unless they're in your house. Did he already get out of here? Guess he did. All right. Bye-bye.